Greetings and welcome back to Factorio. I'm Catherine Skye and we have had a lot of changes to the unfunny uh, mod. So I had actually recorded an episode where I was just really frustrated because there was like no way to get the water down to the ore patch and all kinds of other stuff. And I was like, oh my God, what is going on here? Um, however, I believe that some changes have been made where we can uh, get tank cars and or barrels. Either one would work to get down here to this antimony. It is a long distance away. Um, even though this is the same color, there's many that are similar color. This is antimony, which is what we need, but this is limestone and sandstone. A lot of the minerals do have this uh, this yellow color. Anyway, so I've been told that these are, are available. Um, so I decided to re-record that episode and continue the series because otherwise we would just be, you know, uh, not. So, um, right. What are we going to do next? It's been a while since I've played this. I forgot my save file when I was in Sweden. So we're kind of like, um, we're trying to figure out where we are, what we're doing and all those kinds of things. This is lacking saline yeah it's the brine okay we'll figure out all the things later what is it where is this coming from oh yeah this was the one that we needed to move slightly hello okay wrong key there we go why is this not the correct oh belts have been changed oh dear Okay, let's figure out and see if the um, if the recipes have been changed as well. That is something we need to figure out. Looks like they have all been removed from my inventory, so we, we don't know actually. No clue right now. This is now called transport belt. Okay, let's see what we got here. Looks like these are making them quite, you know, they're working. They're there. Um, these are having trouble grasping stuff for these. That's not great. Mechanical inserters. Yeah. That ain't no good. No. Nope. And then those are going off to science, I believe. Let's just catch some more of these guys here. Uh, we got to the point of having fast inserters, so that's good. Um, we're going to pick up... Wait, what was meant to go in here? I think those were meant to be fast inserter or uh, belts to go in here. Let's just put this down here and we'll do a whitelist with belts going in there. Okay. It looks like we need to do... So this is what I mean, folks, about like, this is why you don't update the mod. However, I did because the game was literally unplayable without the updates because of the... Well, I mean, I guess you could... What could you do? You could build a whole new water setup out here. But I was like, no, we need tools to play this game. I'm not going to go with no tools. So. Um, so, yeah, we need to we need to do that. Um, anyway, uh, we have the. Uh, yeah, I, I just did not want to make a whole nother water setup here because there's way too many byproducts to deal with. It's just too annoying. Uh, I have to draw the line somewhere and that's where it fell. So anyway, let's take off a few of these and replace it with a fast inserter over here. Uh, remember, we need to add power poles because those things are definitely not guaranteed. Okay, this needs circuits. This thing... I wonder if it actually gets circuits. Not from here, it doesn't. Okay. Are we making those circuits? I don't remember. We might be. We're making... Yeah, we are. We're right here. Okay. So those are outputting to... Where land? Here. They're going up. Why are they going up? Oh, they're going down this way. I see now. Okay. So those are going into this box. I'll go ahead and just grab it from the box for now. Um, and just have these make... Uh, the current level of stuff. There we go. All right. Okay, so I'll just put those there for now. Um, what we really want, though, is to get these on the bus. 
Now, I don't think we actually made a, um, a belt for them. I think they're just hanging around here. Wait, where were they? Over here. Right. Okay. Yeah. That literally ends before, uh, as it's going into the box, but we can actually do something like this here and just get, um, these, these new structures made as soon as we get some, we definitely need some thingy-majingies. Okay. They're, we're lacking belts. We have six. That's some. Okay. Uh, okay. So this thing is grabbing basically all the belts, which is not really ideal. Let's just put some in here. Um, and then, cause we still want it to grab some, but we do need these things made first though. All right. Splitters. We can get those splittery do's. Let's grab these as well. All right. So let's try to get the material up here. So it's going to come where exactly? I don't even remember where, oh, it was here actually. Okay, sure. I am really looking forward to the time when we can have actual robots doing some of these deliveries. That would be quite nice. Wow. That was lucky. Okay. Um, how far does this one go? Yeah, I was thinking it might be there. But what if we did a something like this to I ran out. Also, that's one of the things I hate doing is running out of stuff in the middle of a project. And it's like, uh, help. Where was I? Help, help. So uh, let's go back to where we were, wherever that might be. Uh, yeah, here. Okay, here. Cause it's like, uh, do we remember where stuff went? No, of course not. Why would we do that? Scary times. Okay. So this thing has just gone up. We needed from this side, right? Yes. So there to here and we're out again. Gosh, darn it. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. We're still lacking belts. Okay. All right. I put as many as it could handle. That's 13, which is great. And then, ah, it's here. Okay, cool. So from here, it doesn't actually take much, I believe. It's just going up there. All right. So those go there. And then this one, did we connect it on this end? I've com completely forgotten. I don't think we did. Let's go and connect it though, because this is kind of important. Okay. There is where something happens, but not what we need. We need it to go down here. Okay. So that can keep on going down here. And actually maybe we should do a, this and have it come down here so we can have a split and take part of it to the right and part to the left. I think that would be quite nice. Cause no doubt we're going to need these things for other materials and stuff and things. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's just put the ghost in there. So it'll uh, fill in when we walk by that's easier than like manually finding it every time. So yeah, there we go. Dude, take all you can, please. There we go. Undergroundy splitters and we're good. Okay. Do these, these actually need an output, uh, that is fast because they are too slow and this will make things a lot better now. So these are getting what these also need a fast input. It seems like, so I will take this off and just replace with this. We don't really need these things. I think this is enough to keep it stocked. It looks like enough. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Nice. Things be going nice here. Also, this doesn't work anymore. Um, oh no, it's getting the coal. Never mind. I thought it was taking the sheet aluminum, which is actually this one. Uh, this seems like it's doing okay there. All right. Now we have the things and the stuff. We are actually over capping here with this. So let's go ahead and put in another power pole for those that deserve it. Hooray. So more splittery do's, more thingy stuffs 
And we also need more belts. There we go. 147. That's something. It's not much, but it is something. I do want to see what we can build in terms of train wagons or... And I don't know if these have been granted to us. Okay, we have cargo wagons and a locomotive, but I don't know if we can actually get tank cars. Yeah, that looks like it. Maybe. I would be delighted if there was a tank car here. Hello? We get a pump and a storage tank. I thought we already had these things done. Logistics, we get four times undergroundies. Okay. All right. So where do we have barrels? Okay. Barrels probably come here. Ah, yeah, they do. They do. They do. What about a tank car? Uh, okay. Might be here and I'm just not seeing it. That could very well be. It could be in the mishmash of the name, uh, which I'm not sure what the name is. Let's see, let's see tank car. Is that possible? Uh, hmm. Wagon, maybe? Here it is. Fluid wagon. Oh my God, you're going to really make me take it with barrels. Okay. All right, that's fine. Sure, why not? We'll, it'll be fine. We'll just figure it out. It will be fine. Uh, we have the labs working, which is great. We um, These are working quite well now. And um, it won't take long before the fluid handling is done, which means that we can make barrels. Uh, which means we can take the water where we need it to go. Now, I think we set up, let me find where that would be, where we are making train tracks. Hello. They are there, wherever that might be. Running, running. Did we do we have some? We have 29. That's not a lot. Let's see if we have enough. Ah, yes, we do. Plenty. Excellent. Um what else? We do we do have a train, right? I'm pretty sure we have a train. We do. Okay. This train is doing stuff. Good. All right. We also want to get this part uh, radar enabled because it's kind of dark. So let's add a radar here. These are the burner radars. Uh, sure. Ah, that's not, it's not fuel. Oh no. Uh, do we have a fuel thingy that we can add here? That looks like fuel to me. Uh, yeah, this is fuel actually. Nice. Excellent. We'll take that fuel up here and we can share it with the locomotive. That's actually kind of double duty. Quite nice. I like it. So let's get that burner radar chucked in here and we can add a kind of a basic, the mechanical inserter is more than enough here, more than enough. Okay. Um, I believe these were quite complicated, so I think I would like to get these things, uh, another one made or maybe more than one made. I'm not sure what some of these items are, like those bricky things. Those look complicated. Uh, are we making bricky things here? We might be. We might be making bricky things. These are technical, technical words, so be careful. Don't trip on the technicalities. <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. Bricky things. Where are you having that? Hiding them brick things. Where you be? Hmm? Okay. I don't know where they are. I am looking for them. I actually am not seeing any of those brick things. They may or may not be made in the factory. I don't even know what they're called. So that makes it difficult to find them slightly. Um, let's take a look at FNEI and see if we can craft a locomotive. Oh my God. No, 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 no. I'm trying to spell it in Swedish. It's actually this in Swedish. L -O -K. Oh, it's not even printing the uh. Oh, it is, there it is, there it is. Look, right, no, locomotive, there it is. There it is, there we go. So we need, uh, both of them are saying unavailable. Oh my God. What is this one called? Basic locomotive. All right. Let's try that one better. 
basic. When, when I come back from Sweden, it's always very difficult to try to get back here um, because many things are very better there and um, I have a hard time for sure. Tube boiler. Let's see what needs those um, bricky things. Bricky bricky. Clay bricks. Okay. So we can pick up some clay bricks. And pick up the other items that are needed. It looks like we need small storage tank, which is those silvery wire stuffs. Silvery wire stuffs and clay bricks. That's all we need, I think. All right, so I'm going to kind of look on the bus and see what our choices are for... Oh, silvery wire things right here. Beautiful. Nice. Okay, is that enough? All right, now clay bricks. Um, did we make these? Uh, those are not clay. These look like clay. Are these clay bricks? They are. Nice. Okay, let's pick those up. We can make one. Yay. So now we're missing that sheet stuff, whatever that might be. Uh, pretty silvery sheet stuff. <laughs> Technical terms, I tell you. It will be fine. Lovely. Oh, yeah, we have tons of it. Iron sheet. Okay, nice. Nice. I'm going to make a couple of these. I'm also going to make a couple of cargo wagons. We are going to need to, I think we're going to have to do barrels here um, because that's basically the choice we have. I don't think we have other than that choices. Okay. It says we need latex. Uh, do we have that? Let me see if we have that latex. I'm hoping, here it is, latex processing, okay. So we do have latex, good. It's made from s coagulated latex and steam. All right. Okay, I hope this doesn't turn out to be a disaster. I'm trying, I'm trying hard here. Okay, latex, new rabbit hole, it's fine. So latex comes from coagulated latex and steam. That comes from many things that we don't have. We don't have any of these three items. Alginic acid and clay. All right. I know alginic acid. Weren't we using that in C-Block? Pretty sure. That gives us an organic binder. All right. Um, holy. I, I don't even know where to put this latex uh, thing at all. No clue. Um, I think initially we will... Uh, I think we'll control the output of the barrels and then later we're going to do them via um, flying bots. But right now we don't have that. So let's start from the beginning and use Matthias's Christmas tree method of fixing this whole situation. Let's do that. Okay. Crafting this, we need a chemical furnace one. Okay. We're going to do it upside down Christmas tree because I want to have the product down here because I think we're going to need more stuff up here. Actually, no, no, we should have it elsewhere. Let's put it down here, maybe. We can put it right side up Christmas tree then. Okay, so this one is going to do latex. We have advanced latex. Ooh. We still need other stuff for this, though. Latex and wastewater, and that gives us just latex. Um, this one needs silica sand. I don't know if we have a lot of that. Aluminum hydroxide. And it uses ash. Uh, let's see if we have aluminum hydroxide. Aluminum hydroxide. There we go. We have two things making this stuff, which are both not in our thingy. That's annoying. Um, we'll have to go... I want to go and look at this because if we are able to use extra byproducts that could be a big win um let me put down our radar first because apparently i forgot let's put one here okay and you get a mechanical inserter okay and then oh okay nice it's fine it's fine nobody died it is fine try to chill it'll be fine it'll be fine now up here we need one but we don't have a regular radar can i get a regular radar 
I would really like a regular radar craft. How? Why am I using burner ones then? Maybe because we didn't have green circuits. Let me see if I can craft these. Oh my god, we can. Oh boy. Okay, fantastic. I'll just make all of it that I can. And can I? We don't have the middle um, thing for bots yet, which is annoying. But it will be fine. We'll fix it. We'll fix it. All right, I'll put that one in later. So the aluminum hydroxide is coming out of this machine. We have tons of it. So that's an ingredient we have. That's great. Uh, let's see if we can, f uh, hello. Hello. Let's try this one. Ash, we need, what about coagula, co that we don't have. Silica sand. Isn't that that stuff we have mountains of, or is it the stuff we're waiting for? Is this silica sand? Cause that looks awfully like it. No, that's just silica. Is this a silica sand? No, crushed quartz. No. Um, what about this? There's silica sand, but yeah, we're not using that anyway, or we're not getting enough of that. So nope, sorry, latex. You're going to have to go back to your regular recipe. So coagulated steam and, or no, <laughs> coagulated steam. What an idea. <laughs> uh, all right. So let's just make regular latex here with steam needed. Okay. And then the next step is the coagulated latex, which is in a separator one. I have that actually fun. Okay. Raw latex, make it from rosin. Let's just do it from the easier one. Cause we don't have the other stuff. It's more, more stuff. Okay. Next, next then we have coagulated. So now we need, Oh, I'm pretty sure. You know what? Let's check organic binder. I'm pretty sure we don't have this, but we might organic binder. We are making it somewhere. Oh no, we want to have product. Okay. So we don't have that. Um, what about formic, fomic, formic or fomic? Formic acid. Isn't that what ants use in their sting that makes it so stingy? I'm pretty sure it is. I played the game, you know, uh, empires of the undergrowth. Good stuff. I don't think we're making this stuff. Let's check though. No results found. Okay. So those are two things that we definitely need. Okay. We're back now. Let's make the things. So, uh, raw latex collag, 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 oh my God, words, alginic acid and clay in a basic centrifuge. Okay. So that goes here. Um, let's just do the organic binder. Yes. And how do we get the alginic acid? Oh, oh God. There's, oh no, I don't actually want to make this now. I, this is getting too deep for me. This is getting like, oh God, scary runoff. Help. I need Matthias here. He's so great at this. Uh, all right. Do we have any of these things? Calcium chloride. I would love if this interface with factory search, uh, to look up the thing, calcium chloride. No results found. Oh boy. Okay. Sodium carbonate. Carbonate. Nye. I wonder if we actually need latex. Cause I'm beginning to wonder whether this is worth it. Sodium alginate. No results found. Holy crap. There's nothing. So now that's another three different ingredients that we need to put into just one process. Um, okay. New, new question. How much is latex used in barrel rubber, rubber, rubber stoppers? I'm guessing it's probably needed a lot. Like rubber is used in 40 different things. Okay. So we're going to have to set this up eventually. I feel. Uh, this is, yeah, we don't get any choices. Alas. Okay. Latex. Let's go. Coagulated thingy. Uh, still working on this thing. All right. I'll make making alginic acid. No. <laughs> All right. So this needs <clears throat> three different things for this. Um, let's see. This one's going to make the alginic acid. Okay. Yes. And then, 
Uh, calcium chloride is made in a destructive distillation thingy. Okay, and we're getting sodium carbonate from that as well. I think we needed that too. Let's see, destructive distillation. Okay, this one is going to do the sodium carbonate. Sodium carbonate, all right. And that gives us the calcium chloride and the thingy thingy. All right, alginate. Oh, there it is. So those both go there. Good. So the sodium alginate. Oh, the sadness. Ah, uh, we need, oh, for God's sake. No, we need more silica help. Somebody told me that the silica problem has been solved. I'm very curious as to how that has been done. I have no clue about this. Crusher one. Okay, so these go here. Let's do it. Sodium alginate. There we go. And then probably we're going to need this, this one as well. Algae block. So how do you make this? Salt and seaweed. How does that, where do you get that from? Carbon dioxide and mineralized water in a general farm. Let's see. Do I have a general farm? That's a lab. Uh, here we go. Oh, yes, the icon of these is so nice. <laughs> okay, unknown key. Gives us moss. This is seaweed. Okay. So that goes into that thing. This one is into its own line here. Okay, so that's one part of this process. We're still terrified to do anything else. Okay, that's going to get clay as well. All right, so the next thing is... What else do we need from here? We need the raw latex and formic acid. All right, let's just go for that then. Raw latex. Uh, where? Oh, it's probably a this. Whoops. Raw latex craft. Need sap, water, and methanol. Okay, and that's made into that. Sap water and methanol. Oh, that's proper water, I guess. Uh, there we go. I think we can get... We have sap, don't we, over here? We do. We have all this sap over here. Beautiful. Um, and I don't... We might have methanol. It's methanol, right? Methanol. Yep. Uh, search. Meth... Uh, no. This feels like such a waste, though. Because... Oh, it's in the wrong thing. Um, because we're going to... Well, no, we have to make the rubber anyway. It'll be fine. <gasps> we have this being made. Oh, no. Exciting. Okay, that's great. That's being made over there. Yay. So we're getting something from there. Hooray. Oof. All right, next thing. What else are we doing here with the latex thingy thingy? What to this? Coagulated latex. Yep. So uh, formic acid... Oh, uh, okay. Kikiruk. Hello. What is this? Why? Slaughterhouse one. I'm very sure we don't have one of those yet. Slaughterhouse one. I need lead sheet, wherever that might be. I think I know where it's being made. Does that ever happen to you? Like when you're like, Hey, I made that 3,000 years ago, but I know where it's being made. Like, I know where this is being made. I did it. And I, I remember, even though it was like a billion years ago. Uh, let's just do something like that. And Slaughterhouse. Is there? Okay, still needing that lead sheet. That should be enough. It's in this tab. Uh, Kikiruk farm, slaughterhouse. We probably need a Kikiruk farm as well, I'm guessing. I wonder where these animals come from. I'm kind of curious about this. So this has a Christmas tree of many branches. This is slightly scary. Like, not, not slightly. This is terrifying. God, this is rough, man. All right, it'll be fine. Okay, Kikiruk is next. So we're going to make things formic acid yeah and then 
To get the Kikaruk, we need them in the Kikaruk farm as we have anticipated. I'm saying this like in Swedish because I am learning the language, you know. Uh, I'm really excited to move. I am like doing everything in my power to get there ASAP, right? So this is 15. Oh, we need two of these, I guess. Kikiri cocooning. All right. I think we need the whole thing. So this, we need the larval, then we need the others, and then larval from Bactona seeds. Uh... Looks like this is a starter, maybe? So you get five to eight from the Bactona seeds, and then this one gives you more of the uh, the continuous growing of these things. So do we... needs 15. So this is going to have to be like on overflow. Only overflowed uh, larval larvas can go there. Um, all right, so let's put in the first one, which we are going to need another one of these. I think it makes two as well. Okay, let's click this. We're going to get them from the Bactonuses. We'll probably hand feed this, actually. How many does this need? It needs 15 to grow its first... Wait, what? Hold on. Wait, no, 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 no. Really? Oh, I is confused. Wait. Oh, no. This one is not that. This one needs to be this. Right? No. No! Oh, okay. So, we get the lar- Why do we not need this? I'm confused by this. Let, let's look at this. Okay, so larval stuff comes from either the Bactona seeds or the cocoon. Okay, the cocoons cost 14 flowers and some kikaruk. Wait, what? Why would they make it use the end product to make these things and not give you these back? Why wouldn't you get those back? Um, this doesn't look great. I gotta say, it doesn't look great. Anyway, let's get the larval into the regular thing. Wait, where do they come from again? They come from either cocoons or the Bactona seeds. Let's do the Bactona seed thing. So these are making... All right, this, let, um, grumble. Okay, it's fine. We only need one of those. This gives us this to making the kikaruk. And these are the kakuni thingies. Perfect. So there's no kind of like, unfortunately, it doesn't seem like we're left with any, any more of the um, animals. Like there's no like breeding area, which is a bit uh, odd. I feel it's odd. Uh, because we, um, it's a very expensive on Bactona seeds, but it's okay. We will, we'll, we'll it will be fine. It'll be fine. We will get it. We will get it. We will get it. Okay. So. <sighs> I think the cry is ready to happen. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> It'll be fine though. It will be, it'll be okay. And we'll just, um, yeah, we'll just fix it somehow that it will work. Uh, maybe this way. Yeah. Looks like we're out of pipes. Let me go and find pipes. Wait, what, what's happening here? Why is there no, uh, electricity here? Are these electrical? No. Oh, there's some disconnection that happened apparently somewhere. These are all also out of power. Where did that happen? Where did I move stuff around? Um, these are on the same thingy. Isn't this where all the power is? Are we out of like power? Maybe we don't have enough uh, filling. Hello. Okay. That would be the problem. Let's just put these in here. And why are we not getting enough stuff? Why aren't we getting enough processing here? We are too much iron oxide. All right, well, we know how to fix that. Uh, 
I should research better weapons so I can just like nuke this stuff. Great. Yay. Wait, why? Whoa, no, 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 no. Oh, this was supposed to go in here, which is not being used. And these, they might not have even been full. Oh no. Okay, this also goes down here. And those go down there, which is also full. Yeah, I think this is just a mess and a half, basically. Um, yeah, how do we fix this, though? How do we get get these things working? These were supposed to catch this stuff from the belt. Okay, nothing is currently working because there's no power. Um, let's get that iron oxide back here. Where? Where'd it go? There it goes. Okay, let's grab some raw coal and just put that in. So that should get these working. That's good. Okay, so now we're getting some of this. Why is this not going into there. So this one is going straight that way, which doesn't help us at all. I think it needs to just, the whole thing should go. This one goes this way and then goes that way. So I think this needs to just turn and go here. Or, alternatively, it can do a this. Because that one's not doing anything anyway. Seems like it's not going anywhere. So it's just a waste of belt here. Okay, there we go. So now it's actually doing something. But we ran out of uh, stuff again. Okay, so is this going to be sustaining? Let's. Okay, there's our coke. It's finally unloading, which is nice. I mean, we could put in a couple of mechanical inserters uh, if we wanted to. Just to make sure that some of it gets out. And that would help this situation a bit. There we go. We're getting coke on the line. That is good. Okay, hooray. Oh boy, okay. So, we were down here working on stuff and things. <laughs> I know, one tiny dive into latex and this is what happens. Oh, we, and we didn't even mean to go there. We meant to get pipes. We didn't even mean to find that our, our factory was struggling badly. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Okay, 200 pipes. Have I been... Uh, I think I've been... Must have been handcrafting the undergroundies, maybe. I Or did we? I don't even... You know what? I'm going to look. Underflowies. Under. Underflowies. There they are. No results found. Oh, that's wonderful. Okay. How much do they cost? Gravel, bolts, and pipe. Oh. I don't think we got anything like that near here. No. I think we just have to get some more stuff and just craft them on our own. Okay. We need the gravel now. Let's see where that's going kind of have like no clue where stuff is sometimes because we've moved stuff around so much and it's been like okay where how huh uh gravel i think is on to the right somewhere uh you know what factory search we don't need to bumble around not anymore now that we have factory search everything is findable hooray okay those are there hooray so they're outputting gravel to these boxes, which I guess we don't have any anymore. They kind of finished doing the thing and the stuff. Hmm. Okay. Let's see the other things where those are being made. Those are up here. 
And these are not crushing anything any longer. Okay. What do they take? Regular stone. Okay. Do I have any regular stone? No. Hmm. Well, I guess we need to really just hook this up to a stone deposit, really. Um, yeah. So where is our... Let's find map stone. That's limestone. Oh god, I forgot where you get stone from. If it's like you have to distill it from limestone or what. Let's see, stone comes from... Okay, quartz, you get stone, raw quartz, yep, stone, limestone, you get gravel and stone. That's probably what we want. We want limestone crushed into gravel and stone. Is that what these are doing? No. Limestone. Crushed stone, stone into gravel. No. We want limestone into... No, dude. There we go. Limestone into gravel and stone. I think this is what we want, really. Um, so gravel goes there. We decided and then stone goes out here. Perfect. This is regular stone, right? I just want to check. These are stone. Yes, that looks like regular stone to me. So... We need to get this limestone here to where it needs to go. Did we make? We did. Beautiful. So I'm going to do this um, just to put power poles in, which is usually a nice little. You skip to or you skip uh, a space. And this one can be the entire space. Okay, and then we put the power poles right here, and that should work a treat. Just gotta make sure they're connected to other things. There we go. Nice. Something is working. Hooray! Alright, so that goes up here. That's a bit of a way to travel, but it should be fine. All to get gravel, right? Like, there's so many rabbit holes you have to just venture into head first. Ugh, this is crazy. I'm gonna go ahead and turn these to the side for now. Uh, because I really would like to get some gravel uh, so we can make those pipes. I can't believe we're doing this just to make pipes. It's a bit wild. Okay, oh, we can also put these in here as well. We don't even have to wait. Alright, take these. Go, go, go and put in some power uh if we had something to connect it to hooray it's so weird when you're used to building without it it's like all of a sudden we have many things oh wow there's gravel there's gravel hooray got it perfect i'll just chuck some more of this limestone in here just to get it out of my inventory all right there, we got our gravel. Excellent. So now, I want to make... Yes. Well deserved. There we go. I wonder if I can grab some more. I can. Let's grab some more of this stuff. And these probably need to be... These guys, because otherwise they're never going to pick up enough. And it's going to take forever to get anything going with this. All right, so now we're lacking lead sheets. Or a lead plate, I should say. Uh, still lacking lead plate. Mm -hmm. hmm. All right, that should do us for a tiny bit anyway. Uh, however, I think we're going to need a fair amount of pipes in this build. It's going to be eh, slightly significant, I would say. At least we made our Christmas tree of joy and doom. Yes, all of those things. Isn't that nice? 
Yeah. Ah, and we have no more pipes up. Let's go buy pipes. Oh, we forgot to buy them all together, actually. Ooh. Let me buy them here. Uh, because this has auto-fed lead and all that stuff. And now we can make a few of these uh, underflowies. So let's put the underflowies there. And then the regular pipes. Uh, there we go. This is, yep, that's not actually moving fast enough. Let's get our power pole there. Excellent. All right, so that's going to give us a few pipes, which is great. We're still getting some more uh, underflowies, which is also great. And now we can finally begin our build at the very end of the episode. All we wanted to do was make a barrel. And instead, we're on this wild goose chase for latex, which will actually help with the rubber long term. But yeah, latex for barrels. And it's massive. And we're not even close. So anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Unfunny Science in Factorio. I am Catherine of Sky, as always. Thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I'll see you next time.